Public transit can be a great option for folks who live within the city of Fresno, but not all of our residents can afford to do that. So what you'll see in a lot of rural communities are multiple cars at a residence, but maybe only one of them works. They have been priced out of homes here in Fresno, and they have to live on the outskirts of town. Public transportation in these communities looks like maybe a couple of stops that are close enough, but there's not a lot of sidewalks, so where do you put a bus stop? Inspiration Transportation is a nonprofit organization here in Fresno that services rural communities, allowing folks that don't have access to public transit or a car to be able to get where they need to go when they need to do it in an affordable and clean way. Getting to medical checkups, employment, necessity types of trips that rural communities need to access and low income community members need to access. What we find in a lot of the communities that we serve, they've been positioned where there's more industry around them. So anything that we can do as an organization to not pollute their air, that's what we're trying to do. And that's why we use a completely electric fleet of vehicles. And people that really need to get somewhere can give this place a call and get a ride. Transportation is a space where the things that are guiding those services, the legislation and the rules and the requirements have been put in place decades ago. Funding can be difficult sometimes because I've learned folks are more comfortable funding things that fall in line with what has been funded before. Beneficial State Bank and how they became part of Inspiration Transportation's journey is I was Googling how to set up a nonprofit. It was quite empowering to be able to have one-on-one -on -one conversations with the, the bank manager about the steps I needed to take. All of my work in the nonprofit space has been a learning experience and the opportunity to work with a bank that was willing to help me learn more, I couldn't find that any, at any other institution in town. What I would love to see happen if the money were aligned with the values, we could expand this service starting with the communities that needed the most like single moms who are used to walking miles to a local bus stop. Now they can pick up the phone, they can call and get a ride to where they need. If we can really dig deep and align our money with our values, it really is like playing a long game and it's better for all of us.